Hey Libras, welcome back to my channel. So we're gonna get into it and see what's the vibes. See what spirit has for you guys at this time. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you guys for all the likes, comments, subscribe, shares, views, tips, donations, and bookings. I really appreciate it. So take what resonates, leave what does not on this table, as this is general, right? If you have a Libra anywhere in your chart, then you belong here. So let's get into it and see what's the overall energy at this time. No place like home. Some of y'all feel like y'all found y'all person, right? It's no place like home. <clears throat> she over there singing, I wanna thank you, Heavenly Father, for shining your light on me. It took some time. So let's see, what's the real energy here for my leaders? Message in a bottle. Somebody want to send you a message. Chaos and conflict. Maybe somebody want to send you a message after there was some kind of chaos and conflict going on. They want to send you a love note. So we're going to get into it and see what's going on. What are the messages here for my Libras? In regards to this overall energy. Three of Wands. You could have definitely turned your back on someone and was watching your ships come in. Focused on your money. Maybe you got into it with somebody and then... You decided to focus on your finances. Also work on your creative ideas, right? Queen of Cups. So this could definitely be your energy, right? Queen of Cups, loving, caring, empathetic, right? You take pride in who you give your love to, right? You don't just be giving your love to anybody, any old body. What are the messages here? Ten of Wands. This person was causing conflict, right? A burning. You could have turned your back on this fire sign. For some of you, it's a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sag. But you could have turned your back on this person because you felt like they was a burden. They was coming with chaos and conflict. Messages here. Page of Wands. Now someone maybe want to communicate, right? Message in a bottle. This fire sign is maybe now wanting to communicate. They could have felt like they were being immature. You guys could have also gotten some good news about what you're working on passionately and creatively. What are the messages? Seven of Cups. Maybe someone is wanting to communicate that they're not trying to cause an illusion. Queen of Wands, Six of Wands. So this could definitely be your energy. You receive some good news. You're no longer in an illusion about a lover, maybe a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It's like you and this Queen of Wands energy, victory and success, passionate new beginnings. You could have also watched your ships come in and now you're taking that low home, right? You got some good news, a good return on your investment, right? Clarify this three of wands. Five of cups. You definitely turned your back on the water sign and now they are in regrets. Could be a Pisces, but you let go, right? Even if it's not, right? You decided to stay still, right? And get some type of enlightenment. Clarify the queen of cups. The magician and the wish fulfillment. So you guys manifested, right? You started focusing on yourself and manifested. Maybe some travel. Clarify so the ten of wands. The chariot, exactly. Moving forward from this burden. 
Knight of Pentacles, right? This person was slow to act, right? They didn't want to give you a solid offer. You guys could have also released some type of burden, maybe in regards to your finances. And now you guys got some uh, a message from maybe a new job and you moving forward, right? To reliable and stable, right? Four wands, a union. Someone also wants to give you an offer in regards to a union, a relationship, marriage. Where are five page wands? The devil. Big Empress energy. So this, this could be you being very passionate or somebody wanting to send you a message maybe about some sex or some type of passion, right? They have passion for you. Or you guys release some type of addiction. Clarify some of the cups. The tower. It's like you guys release that illusion and cause the tower. Maybe after being backstabbed and betrayed multiple times by this devil, this Capricorn, this childish person. Everything was all about sex, right? This king of wands. Now they're mad and they're heartbreak and discontent and boredom, right? They could have put you in a third party. But they tell them why you make my love come down. Let's see what the Kipper got to say. You guys definitely have high honor, promotion, like I said. Maybe your workplace was toxic. What's going on here with the first row? What's this all the cups? Mature man. So you guys are mature. You guys travel away from maybe an older man as well. And this person could now be in their head in a mental imprisonment. I'm hearing doctor, I'm hearing dad, wealthy man, right? This man can have some money, but there's some type of change, maybe to this person's finances. Maybe it's yours, right? Maybe you was, uh, you turned your back, you was in regret, and you focused on your money, and now you guys are in this wealthy man energy. What about a magician, queen of cups magician? Privileged lady, can't make it up. You guys manifested to be this privileged lady. Some of you guys could be divorcing or ending a relationship, like I said. Well, if I had a ten of wands chariot. Sudden wealth. You guys are moving towards sudden wealth, right? Beef. Maybe also moving away from this thief, right? You have high honor. You got a promotion. Someone was causing chaos and conflict, trying to steal. And I just got a confirmation on my watch. Clear by the page of wands, the devil. Message of concern. So whoever this childish person was, they could be in bad health now, right? This person is all about sex. Now this person could be in bad health, going to the courthouse as well. Maybe some of you got subpoenaed for this person, or you got this person is wanting to send you a message of concern. This person was very immature. For some of y'all, it was a feminine, or this person was is no longer your main thing, right? Or you wasn't this person's main thing. You going on a new journey. Someone's wanting to come through and give you a ring. Clarify the seven of cups in the tower. No longer in poverty. I told you guys a lot of the times, marriage. A lot of the times, towers are not always bad, okay? Because this tower here has gotten you out of poverty, right? You manifested to be this privileged lady. And you will be receiving some type of unexpected income or blessing, right? So let's see. Let's get you guys some advice.
what is that advice here for my Libras at this time? Somebody want to bring you a ring and tell you this time is going to last forever. It is Mercury retrograde, y'all. So, y'all know them exes be coming back, right? What is the advice here for my Libras? You can't save your face and your ass at the same time, okay? So this person could be trying to save their face and their ass, right? But this person is intrigued by you mentally and physically. Advice here. Manifest the fuck out of your dreams like you've been doing. Obviously, it's clearly right here. Spirit is wanting you to manifest the fuck out of your dreams. If you want to become a privileged lady, you can. Or man, you can. You just have to manifest that shit. Advice here for my leaders. Dance like everyone else can go fuck themselves. <laughs> Release this person, this toxic, devilish person. This immature person that thinks about sex. Tell them to go fuck themselves. I'm here when you slow, you blow. So this person took too long. This person was slow. Now they sing in this ring, right? Advice here for my leaders. It's up to you to find the beauty in the ugliest days. And people aren't ignoring you, okay? Maybe some of you guys are actually ignoring this person at this time. Now they saying you're more than just one woman. You're blowing my mind with the love that you're giving. Let me get one more advice to leave us. Masculine or feminine, prayer is dope as fuck. So make sure you guys stay prayed up, especially against this toxic devilish person, right? Once you start laughing, you start healing. So I feel like Spirit is wanting you to look at this person for a joke, for a clown, right? Especially if they're immature um, and everything is about sex. That's very immature. So start laughing so you can start healing. That has been your message, and I'll see you in the next one.